Exciting week for golf fans here in Madison with the American Family Insurance Championship taking place this weekend. The Wednesday Pro-Am was earlier this morning. Sports director Mike Jocks got to play in that and, you know, typically associated with golf or really any sport comes superstitions. We caught up with some of the pros to learn how they're preparing for the upcoming weekend. It's not so much like left sock first or right sock second. That kind of thing. I don't have any of that, but I think you catch yourself doing, you know, everybody's got them, right? They might eat eat similar times and do things in the morning or if they might meditate or they just whatever the, their routine is I mean I guess that's a superstition in a way just par three tees and you know I need to use a broken tee but I can't use one that someone used in my group ahead of me but I can if it's the only one I can find sort of thing you know and if I pick up a tee and if it's a club or a manufacturer that one I've never played or don't use I can't use that tee so other than that that's about all I got who I should have asked what his superstitions are is Jocko. He had such a hard day of work today. Got to play in the program with his friends from American Family Insurance and his pro Justin Leonard. But before he did that, he had a chance to catch up with one of his old playing partners who uh, just happens to be a golf legend. Well, thank you very much and welcome back to University Ridge. We're standing here with Ernie Els, one of my playing partners from two years ago. Do you, do you remember the 50 foot putt that I drained many, many years ago? I can't. <laughs> You can't remember? It's one of the greatest moments of my life. <laughs> Which hole was it on again? It was on number one, and you helped me ah. read the line. And uh... Listen, I mean, it doesn't happen too often. I should remember these things. You should but, remember I mean, that. Yeah, but I, know, I remember you hit a long golf ball. See, thank you very much. So <laughs> we called you the Big Easy. We called me just the Big. So that's uh, the original <laughs> Big is what you call me. So happy to be back in Madison. This is always a great tour stop. I have not been back, and it's great to be back. Last year was my uh, was our daughter's uh, graduation, so we had to go out west for that and miss this tournament, but made sure I made it into this week again. You know, we're staying down in Madison. My wife's coming up, so it's a really cool place to come and visit. And you've been playing well lately. That's awesome. I've been playing okay. Yeah, I haven't, uh, you know, I got a win in March, but I uh, haven't really struck 100% form, but hopefully we can do it this week. All right, Ernie Els, we appreciate your time. I'll send you a video copy of the putt I made. You're going to make a 60-footer today. That sounds good. All right, thank you very much. At University Ridge, I'm Mike Jocks, NBC 15 Sports. We believe you about the putt, Jocko. It's okay. Still to come less than two weeks after a scary hit in the dugout, Willie Adamas has returned to the lineup. We've got highlights from Brewers and Orioles. Game two right after the break.